In the popular mind, mass extinctions are associated with catastrophic events like giant meteorite impacts and volcanic super eruptions. But the world's first known mass extinction, which took place about 540 million years ago, now appears to have had a more subtle cause, evolution itself. The study is described in the paper Biotic Replacement and Mass Extinction of the Ediacara Biota published September 2 in the journal Proceedings of the Royal Society B. The earliest life on Earth consisted of microbes, various types of single-celled microorganisms. They ruled the Earth for more than 3 billion years. Then some of these microorganisms discovered how to capture the energy in sunlight. The photosynthetic process that they developed had a toxic byproduct, oxygen. Oxygen was poisonous to most microbes that had evolved in an oxygen-free environment, making it the world's first pollutant. But for the microorganisms that developed methods for protecting themselves, oxygen served as a powerful new energy source. Among a number of other things, it gave them the added energy they needed to adopt multicellular forms. Thus, the Ediacarans arose about 600 million years ago during a warm period following a long interval of extensive glaciation. What scientists do know is that, in their heyday, Ediacarans spread throughout the planet. They were a largely immobile form of marine life shaped like discs and tubes, fronds, and quilted mattresses. The majority were extremely passive, remaining attached in one spot for their entire lives. Many fed by absorbing chemicals from the water through their outer membranes, rather than actively gathering nutrients. Paleontologists have coined the term Garden of Ediacara to convey the peace and tranquility that must have prevailed during this period. But there was a lot of churning going on beneath that apparently serene surface. After 60 million years, evolution gave birth to another major innovation, animals. All animals share the characteristics that they can move spontaneously and independently, at least during some point in their lives, and sustain themselves by eating other organisms or what they produce. Animals burst onto the scene in a frenzy of diversification that paleontologists have labeled the Cambrian Explosion, a 25 million year period when most of the modern animal families, vertebrates, mollusks, arthropods, annelids, sponges and jellyfish, came into being. 